everyone, gather around. Chibi Maruko-chan is about to start. so early this morning. Do you have classroom chores? Don't be mean. I am capable of getting up early in the morning once in a while. Well, excuse me. I didn't mean to make fun of you. Sorry. Anyway, I had no clue. There really isn't much to do at 6 o'clock in the morning, is there? Speak for yourself. I have a lot of work to do here. I could use your help if you're free. Okay, I'll be in charge of tasting breakfast. You just keep sending the food over. Huh. You're a smart aleck, you know that? Oh, that's right. There's still some orange juice left over from yesterday, isn't there? There it is! Let's start with this. Vitamins in the morning are so important, I've been told. Ah, juice tastes so good, especially early in the morning. Now let's have some yogurt. You'll be too full to have your breakfast. Wow, an omelette! Luck is on my side this morning. Mm -hmm. Hey, Mom, can you cut an apple? And I'll have another glass of that juice as well. You're still eating. You'll be late for school. Right, I'm out, Mom. Huh? Hey, it's still early. You're heading over to school now? It's not early. It's 7.30. What? 7.30 already? Phew, just made it. <laughs> I got up so early and I still had to rush over here. <laughs> oh, hey, good morning, Maru-chan. <laughs> the first lesson is math, isn't it? Yeah, huh? we have a test today. A test? You don't listen at all, do you? Mr. Togawa made it very clear yesterday. Uh, I remember. You're taking a test tomorrow, so you all might want to review your lessons well. <gasps> don't you even bother to try and cheat off me. <laughs> no one would want to cheat off you. All right, everyone, you can begin now. This test is so difficult. What do I do? Uh, take it easy, Maruko. Calm down. Huh? What's this? I'm feeling a little uneasy. Did I eat something bad for breakfast? <sighs> I was imagining it. Thank goodness. Maybe because I'm nervous. Teacher? Huh? Um, I have a bellyache, sir. Uh huh? Uh -huh. Stop yeah, lying, Butaro! That's right. We just want to get out of taking this test. Of course he is. It's so obvious, too. tomito -kun, do you really have a bellyache? No, uh, uh, really? No, I don't. I'm sorry, Boo. Huh? Don't lie, Butaro! No way! All right, stop. Everybody, please calm down. Get back to your test now. Hey, not good. This is really starting to hurt me now. Should I tell him that I'm in pain? 
If I do, will I get treated like Butaro? I know you're lying too, Maruko! How could you, Butaro? Unlike you, I'm not faking the pain in my belly. If you hadn't done that, then I could have used that excuse. I'll work on a problem to take my mind off it. Let's see. yoshiko said bought three apples at 150 each, and Minoru-kun bought four persimmons at 110 each. Who paid the larger amount and by how much? Huh? Honestly, at this point, I don't care who spent how much. <gasps> I have to ask you to let me cut. I have a problem. It's very serious. Please! <laughs> she looks so relieved. I'm jealous of her. I wish I could switch my belly with hers. Huh? Suddenly, the pain has decreased. <sighs> I guess it goes either way, but it's good to know it can be solved easily. Maruko is way too young to know that a pain in the belly comes and goes like the tide. Gather all around. Times for the 50-meter dash will be noted. Give it your best, okay? No way. I'm beginning to feel the pain coming back. Oh, no. This is quite serious. What now? Okay, get on your mark, please. Get ready. No, I can't. I can't hold it. Hurry up! Go! 9.5. That's quite a record. Way to go, Maruko! Two hours after that, Maruko's belly is still unstable, but she seems to manage it. Uh, again? It almost reaches the limit at times. Stay calm, stay calm. When it's happening, feigning ignorance works out surprisingly well for her. I think I'm finally over it. But what she's experiencing is temporary relief. If you get caught in this trap, then tragedy awaits you for sure. Ho, 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 ho. Huh? Fried noodles and pudding today. Awesome! I should get a second helping. The cooks who make lunch are really good at what they do. Here it is again. The sensation. The attack. Tama-chan, huh? please excuse me. I need to go to the bathroom. I'll be back. Wait, I do as well. Let me come with you. Huh? Uh, of course. I'll go in this one. Okay, I'll go in this one then. <laughs> What now? I can't very well relieve myself with Tama-chan in the next cubicle. A single embarrassing sound and I'll never be able to face her again. <sighs> this is the best chance I'll have. But no, I'll just have to hold it. <laughs> Much better. Uh, yeah. <sighs> While being frightened by the surging pains in her belly, the fifth lesson begins. Well done. Right, next up, Sakura-san, please read it out loud. Yes, teacher. <sighs> I'm glad I'm not feeling any pain right now. The woman played the lute like an expert, and the tune she was playing was ever so beautiful. And then, surprisingly... Uh, oh no, the wave is back! The attack! All the trees and plants began to sing along with it. This one is tremendous. This is the biggest one of them all. Cheerful concert. Even the moon looks enchanted. Yes, that's good. Thank you. It would have been much better if you had read that part with some cheer in your voice, though. Maruko's in the middle of surfing. As such, she finds it impossible to heed her teacher's advice right now. Pain, pain, please go away. Go far away and never come back again.
is nearby. Hang in there, Maruko. This bellyache has made me miserable all day. Just thinking about it makes me really mad. I want it all gone. I hate you all. Maruko's taking her time. Maruko, what is the matter with you? Hi. I've just been born again. Huh? Yes, my day has just begun. It's brand new. And therefore... We shall have a toast to a new day. You sound like some sort of advertisement for a wedding hall. I can feel the sunshine filling up the room. Oh, what a beautiful day it is. I am so happy. And as for Maruko's math test, her score was a measly 20. The score will come back to haunt her when she has completely forgotten about it. <laughs> Maruko wants Matsutake Mushroom. Guys, I ate Matsutake Mushrooms. Huh? Huh? Matsutake? Was it growing in your area? My relatives gave them to us. They must be rich if they can afford to do that. No, no. They just went out mushroom gathering for pleasure. The thing is, they gave us a very small amount, so I wasn't able to savor them. Whatever the amount, I envy you for eating them. Hmm. Hopefully one day I'll get to say it was too little to savor them. You know, I bet Hanawa-kun gets to eat Matsutake mushrooms daily. Yeah, let's go ask him. Hey, Hanawa-kun. Huh? Do you get to eat Matsutake mushrooms every day? You do. Yeah? Now, hold on. Slow down. I don't eat Matsutake mushrooms every day. But you eat them often enough, right? I'll bet. What's your favorite way to eat them anyway? Well, I like the Matsutake mushrooms that come from Tamba. I spray them with some kabusu juice and then grill them. Oh, I see. Though I don't know what kabosu is. I don't know either, but it sounds similar to squash. Can you get Matsutake mushrooms? I really want to try. There's no chance. You're only assuming Matsutake tastes good because it's expensive. Think the same about shiitake and you'll be just fine. Don't look down on me because I was born into a poor family, Dad. Oh, I'm sorry you were born into a poor family. <sighs> Grandpa's not as stingy as you, so I know he'll get some for me. Of course I will! That's awesome! Thanks, Grandpa! You're the best Grandpa in Japan! It's okay. I can do this. Because I, I am the best Grandpa in Japan! Ah! Maruko, that's enough nonsense! Kids do not eat Matsutake mushrooms. You can buy some with your own money when you're grown up. What? Mom's right. Don't rely on other people to feed you. Understand? Yeah, I get it. Sorry, I'm selfish. Oh, Maruko, I know you're disappointed. I'm so sorry. Maruko, let's go buy some of them tomorrow. Huh? I told you that I'd buy you some, so let's go. Uh -huh. <gasps> Please don't. You don't have to spoil her. Wait, are you sure? Yes, sure. <laughs> So we're going out today to get Matsutake mushrooms. Nice! Your grandpa is so sweet. Huh? I'm jealous, but I'm happy she's getting to try them. I'm home! Mom, am I supposed to get dressed up since we're going out to buy Matsutake mushrooms? Not necessary. Uh. Hey, Grandpa. Thanks so much for everything you do for me. Sure, no problem. I'm going to buy you lots of presents when I'm all grown up, so stick around, all right? <laughs> Maruko. Come on up, folks. Special prices all day today. Everything's on sale today. No way, 15,000 yen. Uh, I thought 10,000 yen would be more than enough to get some of those. I thought 2,000 yen or so at most. I mean, we're talking about a mushroom here. A whopping 15,000 yen on some mushrooms? I'd rather spend that in a toy store. Right, so I think... Uh, uh... Grandpa, hold on! I don't think I want them if you're gonna spend so much, then I'd rather have some Ngiri mushrooms.
mushrooms instead. Uh, are you going to cut me off if I buy Matsutake? Uh, sir, I'm sure she means Iringi. I'm not in Giri. Oh, uh, of course. Right, thanks, man. Iringi. It's easy to make that mistake. Uh, yes. How embarrassing. Yep. How embarrassing. That lady heard everything we said. Aren't there any holes around to hide in? Uh, yes, I'll join you as well. Tomoso, Maruko, Maruko a, conversation a conversation of the, of the minds. Around then, at home. Hello, how are you? Relatives sent us some Matsutake mushrooms. It's not a lot, but I thought you might like some. <gasps> Matsutake? Grandpa, thank you so much. I hope you're happy. We're fine with Iringi as well. And I'm glad I got a toy instead of the pricey mushrooms. I'm glad I bought you a toy instead, too. I spent just 3,000. Long live Iringi mushrooms. We're home. What? <laughs> Grandpa Sasaki gave us some Matsutake? No way. And now we've got more, seeing as you bought some, too. They're expensive. It'll be a waste if we don't eat them. So what do we do? It's cool. No need to worry. We decided not to buy any Matsutake. Right. We bought a Ringi instead. Oh. You see, I've never tried a Ringi either, and it looked just as good. But I'm happy I'm going to get to try Matsutake. Hey, I wouldn't mind having one right now. Can you grill one? Just one. That should be enough for Maruko. gets grilled matsutake. What luck! Oh, by the way, do we have any kabusu sauce? Hanawa-kun says that these taste good with kabusu sauce on them. Really? Kabusu on matsutake. Definitely a rich family dish. We don't have any. Try this vinegar. <laughs> hey, that's not bad. It tastes a little like Pacific Soury. Good call, Mom. <laughs> Actually, I have to use the fish grill, so that's why you're getting that taste. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes a little like Pacific Soury. <laughs> Come on, Dad. Take it easy. <laughs> the flavor of the fish is welcome. It is autumn. <laughs> it is autumn! <laughs> Hey, come on! Cut it out, Dad! Sorry, sorry! Right, Hiroshi. You're destroying the experience for Maruko. Maruko, don't let the laughing bother you. Try the stir-fried Matsutake. It's good. Trust me. Uh, no, that's Iringi. Oh, no! How could I make that mistake? It's so embarrassing that the Iringi I bought got me! <laughs> the old man mistook a ringy. <laughs> Fine, Hiroshi, you can laugh at me. You can call me old man a ringy, whatever you want. <laughs> Stop it! Enough of your laughing! Yeah, I'm so tired. <laughs> ah! On this evening game, I wasted all my time laughing. Fantastic! Oh, well, I had some fun. Good drinks and tasty Matsutake mushrooms. Well, I need to thank Grandpa Suzaki for them. At that time at Hanawa-kun's. Matsutake mushrooms, perfect for autumn, aren't they? Yes, they're perfect. Oh, by the way, Sakura-san said that she'd be having Matsutake mushrooms too. I'm guessing she's having some right about now. Well, I do hope she's enjoying it. How could she not? I wonder if she's having grilled Matsutake. He didn't know it was Pacific Sari flavored. I want to eat Matsutake mushrooms. Mom, please buy me some, I beg you. Enough, don't whine. Because of how much you consume, we're already on a very tight budget. We'll go bankrupt if I start buying those. But Sakura said her grandpa would buy them for her. Well, you don't have such a generous grandpa in this house. Why don't you use your pocket money to buy some Oringi? You don't need Matsutake. A ringi will do just as well. Oh, uh, Sakura, I wish I had your grandpa. Little did he know that a ringi was good enough for the very same grandpa of the Sakura family. Ah, that was so good. 
Are you happy now? The monster take and rice was delicious, but the iringi was just as tasty. Yes, I agree. Matsutake is tasty, but expensive. But cheaper stuff can be tasty, too. So, if enoki mushrooms were as expensive as matsutake mushrooms, everybody would want to have some, thanks to their lovely aroma and texture. Yes, you're right. I love enoki mushrooms. I'm so glad they're on the cheaper side. That's not it. The reason the Iringi tasted so good has nothing to do with the price. It's only because Grandpa bought it for us. In fact, it was tastier than the Matsutake mushrooms. Maruko, anytime you want, I'll buy you Iringi mushrooms. Moved by the joy my granddaughter expresses by having Iringi by Tomozo, a haiku of the mind. The next day... See you later! Huh? Grandpa Sasaki. <laughs> good morning, Grandpa Sasaki. Oh, Maru-chan, good morning. Thanks very much for the Matsutake mushrooms. You're welcome. Those mushrooms came all the way from the Tamba area. They were delicious, weren't they? What? They were from Tamba. And now what can city like those? Well, I like the Matsutake mushrooms that come from Tamba. I spray them with kabuzu juice and grill them. So, mushrooms from Tamba are the best? Well, there are many, but the Matsutake from Tamba are the most expensive ones. The best way to have them is to spray kabusu juice on them and then grill them. In my house, such an expensive product was grilled using a fish grill and then sprayed with citrus vinegar. I'm hoping you had the chance to eat grilled Matsutake. Yes, but we did last night. I've never eaten something so tasty in my life before. The Iringi mushrooms that Tomozo bought were tastier. Maruko felt so sorry that she couldn't look Sasaki in the eyes for fear of saying so. 